This is a tinder box right now. Fears are growing the Israel-Hamas war will spread and oil prices will rise. It shows Hamas that the Israelis will target Hamas leaders wherever they are, not just in Gaza, but across the region and indeed across the world. A U.S. official says Israel is behind the assassination of Hamas deputy leader Salah al-Aruri in Lebanon yesterday. His death has extremists in that country calling for revenge. Hezbollah uh, announced that it will retaliate for uh, this assassination. This is the kind of thing that the Biden administration has been worried about. That could spread the conflict north of Israel, just as the situation is also heating up to the south. Iran is stationing a naval vessel in the Red Sea after the U.S. sank three Houthi boats there. That group has Iran's backing, and it's threatening the vital trade route. Confronting an entire carrier strike group from the United States is just, it, it, it has the potential for explosive activity. If oil tankers can't get through the Red Sea, they might have to take longer, more expensive journeys. That could increase the cost of oil and drive up prices at the pump. I'm Amy Kiley reporting.